I want to join the army. These words weren't so painful at first, but the worst came after he was shipped to the front lines. And what blows my mind is it takes this government three weeks to respond to a hurricane, but only three days to get to Iraq. Now let's get back to the track of this young black soldier who's willing to die for the same country that would have enslaved him not too long ago. Fighting for Uncle Sam, but doesn't completely understand what he's fighting for. But fuck it! The army pays tuition. <laughs> and every day he listens to the same story. Don't worry. The enemy is easy to spot. But Al Qaeda don't wear uniforms. And suicide bombers don't wear name tags. And no amount of preparation could prepare for the situation he'll be facing in a few weeks. Man to man, face to face. America to do Iraqi, but no, no. This was no ordinary Iraqi. He had C4 strapped to his waist and a smile on his face as if this was all part of the plan. Because soon he will be with the virgins and Allah. And a lot of you don't understand. They don't cover this shit in basic training. Chapters 1 through 7 in Uncle Sam's textbook all see Boy, face enemy. Boy, shoot enemy. Boy, live as a hero. But now at ground zero, the rules, they change. Can you hear the heartbeat of this young soldier who's facing this decision? If I shoot him, the bombs explode! If I don't shoot him, the bombs explode. See? No one told him to be this hard to squeeze the trigger. The flash from the gun barrel meets the blast from the explosion. Can you hear his heartbeat fading? This young soldier who's dying on a raggy pavement, who soon will be buried below the soil, all because Mr. Bush wanted some extra oil. Since when have two pints of blood equal two gallons of a lead? And if he knew where he was heading, he would have told his mother, I love you one more time, but the time is up. It's too late for that now. There's no restart button in this war game. And no matter what happens, it'll be the same thing. Politicians saying the same thing. Journalists asking the same thing. Um, Mr. Bush, Mr. Bush, why are we still fighting this war? No, really, why are we still fighting this war? Do you know? Do you know? No answer? No reason? Exactly. Yes!